The latest group says seizure of reporters' data worrisome Washington, AP, the latest on a former Senate Intelligence Committee staffer facing federal charges for allegedly lying to the FBI about having contact with reporters, all times local, 12.40 p.m. Ad Choice Advertising in Red Invented by Teeves The Committee to Protect Journalists says it is concerned about the Justice Department's seizure of phone and email records from a New York Times reporter as part of a case against a Senate Intelligence Committee staffer charged with lying to the FBI. James Wolfe's indictment was announced Thursday after the Times revealed the department had secretly seized phone records and emails from reporter Ali Watkins. The newspaper said Watkins was approached by the FBI about a relationship she had with Wolf when she worked at other publications. Advertisement The advocacy group says it's the first known incident in which prosecutors have gone after journalist data under President Donald Trump. Alexandra Eller Beck of CPJ says the seizure sets a dangerous precedent because journalists must be able to protect their sources. Underscore underscore 3.23 a.m. A former employee of the Senate Intelligence Committee has been arrested on charges of lying to the FBI about contacts he had with multiple reporters. That from federal prosecutors on Thursday. James A. Wolf was the longtime director of security for the committee. He was indicted on three false statement counts after prosecutors say he misled agents about his relationships with reporters. The committee is one of multiple congressional panels investigating potential ties between Russia and the Trump campaign that Wolf is not charged with disclosing classified information. Prosecutors say he was in regular contact with multiple journalists who covered the committee, including meeting them at restaurants, in bars, private residences and in a Senate office building. By Taboola by Taboola sponsored links sponsored links promoted links promoted links you may like you financial carriers JC had been working for Credit Suisse in Singapore for five years. So what made him go back to school? E financial carriers under Vikings free online game play this for one minute and see. Why everyone is addicted Vikings free online game under the business times modern woman business times under Emirates explore Dubai where spectacular is every day with Emirates Emirates Sundo save 70.com flights in Singapore at ridiculously low price save 70.com Mundo enjoy compare best credit cards in Singapore compare today enjoy compare enjoy compare Undo.